The Mavic 2 is finally available everywhere, and first impressions are DJI's outdone themselves again. It's got an array of features that builds in the success of its predecessor, the Mavic Pro. One feature in particular, though, that really stood out to me was the 14 stops of dynamic range compared to the 13 stops of the previous model. So I'm going to put it to the test on a 21 stop chart and then some harsh sunlight outdoors. If you're wondering how much of a difference one stop can make in a practical setting, look at these highlights. So that's one stop less, and you can see the detail in the highlights is visible now. I'll be testing the Mavic 2 Pro's dynamic range and comparing it with the Spark, the Mavic Air, and original Mavic Pro. So first up is the Spark. Next is the original Mavic Pro. And here's the Mavic Air. So the Mavic Air doesn't have log, but it records at 100 megabits per second compared to the 60 megabits of the Mavic Pro. And now here's the Mavic 2 Pro. And I'll let the footage speak for itself. In my next video, I'll be building and giving away a custom drone helipad. So follow me on Instagram if you want to see photos of that build. I'll be posting them in the next couple of days. And subscribe for when I finish that build video.